Friday, everyone. Hey, listen, I just wanted to try to kick off your weekend with um, some encouragement to incorporate some art into your life. Uh, I was inspired this morning by a Facebook post I received, uh, received, and it was from a photographer, and the work was phenomenal. It was colorful, beautiful, um, very interesting. And uh, in fact, I'm going to go ahead and look a little more into his work to see what else he has that I, um, you know, can enjoy there. Um, also, I, I follow a couple of musical artists, which I'm sure you guys do the same. Um, so I got a little ding this morning on Facebook with a message saying that this person had um, just released a new cover today. So it was kind of like getting a little package in the mail, you know, that's unexpected. It's a nice little surprise. Also, I have a number of friends who are... Um, musicians and they're not professional but um, that's what they enjoy and so one young fella he um, today posted um, a, uh, some music that he had written and produced and sang and all that so um, anyway so I just wanted to say that um, especially in, in this time in fact I'm, I'm naming this shoot um, art and catastrophe because we are going through a catastrophic time and um, art can be very, very valuable to us um, in times like these. So um, I wanted to encourage you to, you know, to look at artists' work, regardless of what it is, art, you know, drawings, painters, musicians, any, any kind of artwork that you find interesting to, um, to look into that and to utilize that as a, as a resource, you know, something that can help um, navigate, you know, help you navigate through these times because what happens when we enjoy art, you know, say we're looking at a piece, you know, we're, um, we're letting that, that energy and that message of the artist inspire us or maybe, um, you know, just looking at it and, and thinking about interpreting their work and, and dealing with our feelings that may arise in during that interpretation. So, um, we're, uh, art can, can really generate resilience for us, can help develop that. And we're going to need it. You know, we need it to get through this. We, uh, you know, we're being told that there's going to be a second phase or wave to COVID. And we don't even know what's going to happen beyond that. You know, so resiliency right now um, is really, really important. Um, also, another aspect of art, um, besides it being a tool to help develop resiliency, is that it's a record. You know, if you are creating uh, art. And I really, really hope everyone does that. Um, get into your thing, whatever it is. Um, maybe it's something you've put back on the back burner for a while because, you know, life gets in the way. Um, so, you know, I encourage you to get back into that thing. Put your energy into it. Put your time into it. Um, and then, you know, that will be a record. Uh, not just, first of all, it'll be a, a creative process where, you know, you derive a lot of enjoyment and pleasure, but it also will be a record of you having traversed this incredible time. And um, that can be really good for your family and your friends. So, um, uh, you know, I just want to say, uh, dig in, get, you know, Put some energy this weekend and maybe this week. A lot of us are not working, you know, so if you're at home, you have time. And, um, you know, it can be uh, a very rewarding and, and creative time for you. It will generate energy. And that's what this channel is all about, is about inspiring energy, people to, to have energy for life. Creativity generates energy. And then when you share whatever it is you've created, Create it, then that generates and infuses other people with the, that energy. So um, this is a really neat thing. Art is art is a wonderful thing. So um, anyway, I would love to hear like if you've gotten back into something and you know, or if you've been producing or, or creating work. I'd love to hear about what you're doing. Please share it with me. You can go to my uh, YouTube channel and like and subscribe. And uh, anyway, look, you guys have a great week, and I hope that you have a very artful week, okay? Take care, and then I'll be talking to you later on. Okay, bye-bye.